pandemic, lockdowns, riots, civil unrest, looming economic disaster, wars, tensions, earthquakes, fireballs, meteorites from the sky, terror attacks. The cogwheels that keep the engine of this world running are getting stuck and are coming to a halt. Or, in more modern terms, the software that is the operating system of this world is hanging. We need a reset, a great reset. Someone needs to hit the brakes. People long for it. And isn't that convenient? That's exactly what the World Economic Forum proposes. It is the Hegelian dialectic. Problem, reaction, solution. And it is set for the beginning of 2021. An economic reset, a new digital world currency, a health reset, a vaccine with a digital passport. Working and traveling and other activities will be possible again. Life will go back to normal. Or will it? It's not going to be the normal we remember. It will come with a high price. It's going to be a new norm, one of checks, checkpoints, health checks, social checks, and credit checks. We will find ourselves locked in a digital cage where freedom is just another word for nothing left to lose. And that will include all your freedoms. The new norm, the new world order. People have been conditioned to want something new all the time. Do you have the new iPhone? Did you see that new video clip? Did you try that new product? Two genders is boring. Let's have new genders. Let us just change everything. Old is boring. We want something new. Well, now you'll get it. New normal. New money. New world order. And it is not going to be what you ever imagined it to be. The Great Reset is going to be a great disaster. The Bible tells us this. This is what the Lord says. Stand at the crossroads and look. Ask for the ancient paths. Ask where the good way is and walk in it. And you will find rest for your souls. But you said we will not walk in it. Some may say, well, that's Old Testament stuff. We have the New Testament now. But Jesus said, for truly, I tell you, until heaven and earth disappear, not the smallest letter, not the least stroke of a pen will by any means disappear from the law until everything is accomplished. Then, and only then, after all has been accomplished according to God's will, shall there be a great reset and things will be made new. It is God's earth, His creation, and only He is able to make everything new. And all this new stuff in this current world is not really new at all. They are just perverted, twisted versions of the old. And it is destined for failure and destruction. We are quickly, very quickly, moving into a world that is not worth living in. It is not worth living for. Set your heart and mind on the world to come. That great reset will be coming. The question is, on which side will you stand? You must choose, and you must choose quickly. Big changes are just around the corner. Stand at the crossroads and look, and ask for the old ways. Ask where the good way is, and walk in it.